Boring, there we go. Let's begin the game. So how you guys do? The witchers managed to do it. The man alive revealed himself to be not man, but elf. And an elven sage at that. Avalach, for this was his name, hmm. was the elven mage who had helped Siri flee the hunt. Awesome. Then hidden her away on the Isle of Mists. Hmm. Nice. There we go. Okay, so we're supposed to look for three people. Hmm. Let's drag this down a bit. Oh, yeah. There we go. Okay. Let's see what we're all gonna do here. Mm. So let's begin with that person. That guy. Mm. Why would they want to go for that one? Oh, because this one is closer. RPs. Hey! Where did... There we go. Thank you. Oh, what the hell? Oh. Our turret? Let's fish. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what you're doing, game. But I think it's good. Oh. Let's go. We can pay for. Oh, you are here? <coughs> oh, okay. Okay. Friends, come down. Right, I'm coming. You lucky devil, you. You know, I've one regret. That... Uh, ah! Oh, did it just die? Dead. Damn. That was unfortunate. Probably upstairs. We should try to find him. Hey, 
Wake up. Shoo. Back to bed, Nibbles. Wake up. What? What's happening? Who, who are you? I'm Geralt. Your friends asked me to find you, Ferenc, and Ivo. I'm afeard they're dead. Some horror swarmed Ivo saw it with my own eyes. And Ferenc, I heard him. A blood-curdling cry, then the roar of a beast. Let's get back to the hut. I'll protect you along the way. Shame about the lads, really, but what can he do? Come on. But I should warn you, I suffer from narcolepsy, meaning you <gasps> I know what it means. Don't worry, I'll keep you awake. Uh, off we go then. Hmm. Super Mario. I'm afraid that I'm um, going It's gonna be hard to protect them. Good thing we cannot snap him into two pieces. Please don't die to something. That's stronger than me, I'm so Come on, get up. Oh, nipples, you're a naughty kitty, aren't you? <laughs> All right, I'm up. <laughs> what the hell, that naughty kitty? Know much about this isle? Almost nothing. You know it, it ain't on my map. A common characteristic of enchanted islands. You think it's enchanted? It's the one thing I'm sure of. Try to zard on this guy. Oh, okay. Why haven't we been doing things this all along against this sort of enemy? <laughs> that was a lot easier than expected. Foglet? What now, you piece of hell?
Tried to flee the fiend. One of the missing Stubby dwarves. Legs. Two slings dead. Come on! Uh, let's open the Okay, this looks like the right way. <coughs> Apologies. Oh no. That's stronger than me, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Come on, get up. Oh, Nibbles, you a naughty kitty, aren't you? Uh, yes, right. you are. yes you are, yes you are. So, what is it brought you to this strange place? Looking for someone. Here? Mm -hmm. Just kind of turned out that way. Not too keen on talking about it, are you? Not really. Brought you your friend. I sure. Let's hear him then. Wake up. I'm awake. Got <laughs> fun. <laughs> Stand back. I'm opening the door. Gaspar, ah, you seem a bit muddled. Uh, muddled. A bit drowsy, that's all. What of the others? Found one near a monster's den. He was already dead, sadly. Saw another fall from a cliff. Broke his neck. Shit. Roderick told me to have an eye on the snow. Was his nephew. Thanks for helping, and uh, sorry I didn't trust you. Oh, Come everything's him. gone wrong. What'll we do now? This is a boat. weird. You can leave with me, but I need to find strangers. An ashen haired lass. Yes. Oh, dreadful. Sorry. What do you mean? She's cold. Spirits left her. Must have passed shortly before we found her. Let's wait by the boat.
he thinks she did that. Interesting. Ah, oh, the question is, is she truly done? Interesting. Guess not all of Vesemir's teachings have receded into oblivion. A witcher can forget to eat, to drink, to breathe even. But a witcher never ever forgets to care for his blade. <laughs> uh, yeah, I used to repeat that incessantly. Never tired of doing it either. What creature was it? Huh? Creature? One that gave you the scar over your left eye. It's new. I don't remember it. Souvenir from the Cockatrice of Spala. Another addition to the collection. Nothing special. Yours is healed beautifully, though. Avalach. He prepared some special ointments for me. But that was before the curse gripped him. Wonder where he is now. We lifted the curse. He's at Kaer Morhen. Waiting for you. Are you serious? You must be. You'd not jest about something like that. <laughs> A nice thing to wake up to. You trust him? Avalok? He's not let me down to date. Not once. Why exactly is Avalok helping you? Sages have never been fond of humans. He doesn't do it for me. It's about my power. As if it could ever be about anything else. Avalach tried to teach me how to control my ability. He was also making sure I didn't fall into Eridin's hands. What's Eridin after? What's he want from you? What everyone wants. Control of my powers. His homeworld faces annihilation. Eridin's decided to invade ours. Brilliant, wouldn't you say? can't achieve much on his own, so he needs to bring an army. Except his navigators can't possibly move him and thousands of NL between planes. Their abilities won't allow it. Whereas yours will. Exactly. And if I die in the process, well, that's a necessary sacrifice. Hmm. How do you ever start traveling with Avalach? As soon as I had left you and Yen on the Isle of Avalon, I found myself pursued. Eridin and his Red Riders were on my heels. I fled through many worlds, many times. They came very close to catching me once. It was then that Avalach appeared, out of nowhere. He found a portal and took us to a world where Eridin couldn't find us for, oh, perhaps half a year. The world where Eridan couldn't find you, what was it like? You wouldn't believe me if I told you. Try me. People there had metal in their heads. Waged war from a distance, using things similar to megascopes. And there were no horses. Everyone had their own flying ship instead. Siri, stop fooling around. I told you you wouldn't believe me. <sighs> we should have stayed there. <laughs> So why'd you return? I thought the hunter lost my scent for good. I thought I was safe. Besides, I... I wanted to find you. You and Yennefer. You were looking for us. We were looking for you. At times I thought you were just a step away. Other times, I felt like I was going around in circles. <laughs> I'm not surprised. 
There were times I fled pell-mell head first and forward. So tell me how it happened, step by step. Eridin located us mere moments after we landed on Ard Skellig. Soon after, he and his riders surrounded us. I thought it was over, the end. Turned out Eridin had other plans. He produced the phylactery, uncorked it. A fog enveloped us, and Avalach began gasping for air. That's how Eridin cursed Avalach, triggered his transformation into Uma? Yes. He didn't wish to kill him. Humiliation, that's what he was after. But Avalach refused to succumb without a fight. He cast a spell that wrought havoc in the hunt's ranks. And in a full half of a forest on Ard Skellig. Yet it also gave us time to flee. Avalach opened a portal. I leapt in. He was supposed to follow right behind me, but something went awry. Impaired by the curse, he failed to reach the portal in time. We had agreed that if anything went wrong and we were separated, we would meet at his hideout in Venom. But you failed to meet there. Yes, we failed to. Once through the portal, instead of at Avalarch's hideout, I landed right in the middle of Crookback Bog. Mm. That's where I barely escaped it. the crones. And then there was the Baron. <laughs> you know he took me hunting. I killed a wild boar with my sword. I heard. A coincidence, really. <laughs> I had no desire to hunt that day, but it felt wrong to refuse. I'd taken nothing remotely resembling a hunting weapon. I simply hadn't intended to hunt. I was wandering through the forest, breathing deep the air. And then I heard a strange sound. Unsettling. Boar attacked you? Mm hmm Big as a bison, and lumbering straight at me. And all I had was my sword. I had to manage. Did just fine, judging by how the Baron's men remember it. Simple soldiers, the whole lot. But we got along splendidly. A shame I had to leave. Flee. But I didn't want to bring the wild hunt down on them. Apart from which, I knew by then the curse was progressing. So instead of looking for Avalach, I decided to find you and Yen. So how do you even meet a man like Horson Jr.? You and Yennefer were nowhere to be found. And I needed someone who could fix the phylactery. No ordinary craftsman would do. I needed a mage. One with extraordinary powers. Dandelion took it upon himself to help me. It was as if his honor depended on it. He arranged a meeting with a mage, but it proved a trap set by the Temple Guard. Hmm. <laughs> Failed to mention that. <laughs> Probably didn't want to worry you. Later, we learned the Guard did that sort of thing regularly, in the hope of nabbing anyone who collaborated with mages. We needed to find another way. That was clear. Then Dandelion said he knew a man who owned a piece of Novigrad, as he put it, could do more than others. He was certain to know someone who could fix the phylactery. Orson Jr. Mm-hmm. I suspected it might not be the best idea, but I was desperate. I had no choice. You suspected right. Horson was not the ideal partner in crime. Damned Simpleton got it in his head that we cheated him and kidnapped Dudu. Who you promptly freed only to have to flee to Temple Isle. Great idea. We hadn't planned it. Had no time to consider. We just bolted. I didn't even realize the guardsmen were driving me into a trap. Suddenly there I was, and I knew I had to disappear. At once. And that's when you landed back in Skellige. The shore of Hindisfjall. The first pleasant place that came to mind. Hjalmar and I used to swim there. Wait, so... You actually wound up there by accident? I thought you and Avalok had arranged something. No, he simply sensed me use my power. Just as Eredin can sense where I am. Where I travel. Hmm. In fact, Eredin arrived soon after I did. His ride is in tow. Once again, things happened quickly. Lofoten. The hunt's attack, my flight, and then dreams, just dreams. What did you dream? I've had nothing but nightmares lately, pretty horrible. 
Likewise, for the most part. In one, a monster grown from a stillborn child chased you. Ugh. That was horrible. Oh, that one. Actually. In a few nice dreams. For example, in one we sat around a fire, drinking good wine, and all around people danced and laughed. I like that one a lot better. Me too. But these dreams, and the others, ended in some tower. No matter what I dreamed, in the end, I would enter a tower. Everything some time. Tower of the Swallow. Recognize it? Know where it might be? I'm not sure. I don't think so. But there was something familiar about it. And something terrifying. The tower was stark and dead. But at the same time, I felt I had to enter it. Did you? No. Dreams all ended with me searching for the entrance. And the last time, instead of the tower, I saw your grizzled face. If not for the scar over your eye, I'd have thought I was still dreaming. I was afraid you were dead. Found some dwarves here. Said they'd try to wake you, but you were cold as ice, and you weren't breathing. And yet you came in. Who listens to dwarves these days? Speaking of which, they're probably getting antsy. We should go. Got a boat on the beach. Once we land, we'll head for Kaer Morin. On a horseback. Right. Conventional means of travel. They're just better. Though a portal would be quicker. And draw Eredin to us immediately. Rather not risk it. Besides, I hate portals. <laughs> because you always wind up in other places and they are actually supposed Damn. to get you. Oh, they took this boat. Listen, we gotta think of a way to. Oh no. Looks like. They can sense some enemies. Get us out of here. They'll know where we've gone. They'll know how to find me. They already do. Siri, take us home. No, but the, the big question is, will they land in a good spot? <laughs> They're probably gonna fall down from the sky. landing <laughs> Welcome back child standing around come on time to greet the others you've not changed a bit any of you all just like I remembered <laughs> hmm. 
What? Little sis. All here, everyone you asked for help. Avalox resting in the tower, still in pretty bad shape. No reason to do it out here. Come inside. Damn, it's good to see you again. I... Maybe I'll give you two a moment. Tris, please. No, no, y you must have missed each other terribly. A minute's delay won't hurt anyone. No, we should get going. They're waiting for us. Yen, you know the wild hunt better than anyone else. Tell us about the magic they use. Their navigators open portals, rifts that we might encounter the diamond to see you. Oh, yeah? They also summon. Hmm. Ah, yes. Bring all your tools with you. Thought to myself, a battle approaches. Blades will need honing. Plate will need some hammering. That sort of thing. Yeah. Thought right. Thanks, Sultan. Plan to top that by brewing some more Mahakam and Mix. Shade's so volatile, you need to glance at it to set it off like a flaming fart. Very useful during sieges. Nice. Can you craft something for Willing me? Of course. Okay, let's see. Repairs. Oh. No upgrades are needed. All right, we'll talk later, Zoltan. Huh? Where did that go? I certainly hope this gas will work. She's one of us, Geralt. No way we'll let him take her. Esco, I know that look. Something eating you. The hunt could arrive any minute. Yes, Wolf. I know that look. Something eating you. We'll never surrender, Siri. They set things alight. Let's have some fun battle. Soon time for war. An illusion. Greetings, Geralt. If I'm to die today, I wish to look smashing for the occasion. <laughs> Leave my dresser alone. <laughs> nice. Epic use of magic, I must say. That's what magic is truly for, Kappa. Get everybody together. Time to talk. Thank you for coming. The Wild Hunt will be here soon. They're coming for Ciri. Want to take her? We'll stop them. How do you even know the hunt will show? They always know where I teleport to. And they move from place to place in an instant. So what's our plan? Aridin, the king of the hunt. 
He's confident. He'll strike hard, hoping to defeat us with the force of the blow alone. We've got to take the initiative away from him. Foil his plan. I'll generate a magic dome over the fortress. It will scatter them, force them to land in the woods. If they're dispersed out in the woods, we could hunt down small groups of riders. Got our first volunteer for the hunting party. I'm the second. The hunt will try to penetrate into the fortress through navigator portals. I can do nothing against this kind of magic, so you'll need to find and close as many as you can while hunting in the woods. Lambert will make us die meridian bombs. Remember the formula? Of course. Excellent. Erden should work on the portals as well. I shall also give you each an amulet. Snap them in half and you'll become invisible, at least while you remain still or move slowly. Move abruptly, engage any foes, clash with them, and they will see you. Apart from that, they will be able to hear you and smell you. If you come across a large unit, do hmm. not attack. Signal Triss and she will provide support. I'll look for your signal. As soon as I see it, I'll rain fire on the forest. Sweet. Remember, there's only a few of us. We have to help each other, work together. If anything goes wrong and the hunt puts us on the defensive, we pull back, make a stand at the gates of the fortress. The inner courtyard is our last line of defense. If we don't stop them there, we're doomed. Ciri's most important in all of this. The hunt's after her, and we have to defend her at all costs. What do I do? Stay inside the keep. If they break through, come inside. We'll all converge to help you. Out of the question. I can look after myself. Yeah. No one doubts that, child. But remember the most important moment when hunting a monster? <sighs> Wait for an opportunity. After the council, I'll give you an amulet. If you use it, a ball of fire will land where you're standing, just in case. What else do we have that we can use? Since you plan to ambush the hunt in the woods, I could dig some trapping pits, blue stripe style. Meaning? Deep as the dark abyss, bottoms bristling with sharpened stakes. I brought this, my Hackerman mix. Flammable as bone dry saltpeter and plowing sticks to everything. We fill some barrels, stack them in a narrow passage, and fire them up at an opportune moment. You know, Will that even work when everything gets cold? If need be, I could open cracks in the earth, create explosions. I would need to prepare, though. There's the laboratory and the workshop. One thing to remember, we've got limited resources and even less time. We ought to decide what kind of weaponry will be most useful against the hunt. Absolutely. We need to assign one type of weaponry each to the lab and workshop. Anyone have any ideas for the workshop? Been wanting to fix that breach in the wall, but we'll need the same tools to clear the rubble from the armory. Rubble? Haven't you heard? Roof caved in a couple of years back. There's some excellent swords in there. Swords we could use. Filling in the breach seems just as important. They come through there, the siege will be over awfully quick. Fixing the breach in the walls a priority. Let's not forget the laboratory. I started brewing some potions. Like to finish, if you don't mind. I could prepare more of those witcher's traps, but I'd need all the lab equipment. There aren't many of us, so we'll need to prepare as many traps as possible. We won't have time to do much else. Everything settled? Yes, settled. We don't have much time, so let's get to work. Let's sum up. Yennefer will create a magic barrier to repel the main assault. That should push the opposing force into the woods, where Lambert and Geralt will be waiting. They'll use Dimeridium to close the navigator's portals, stop as many warriors as possible from entering the fortress. Triss will be waiting for their signal, then give the riders hell. All others will repel any foes who make it inside the fortress walls. If anything goes wrong, we abandon the outer courtyard, pull back to the keep. Remember, Aridan can't get his hands on Ciri. That's most important. 
Let's look at the map of the fortress, figure out the details. Can't help feeling we've overlooked something important. Don't think about it. What's ready? Haven't had much time to prepare, so not much, honestly. I'm exposing you all to danger, unnecessarily. You worry too much. Wipe that frown off your face, we'll make it. Thanks. For everything. I'll saddle the horses. Come once you're ready to head into the woods. Hmm. All right. It's time. Time. I bet Aerodin is gonna go straight for her. Hmm. Is this going to be Vesemir's final battle? Welcome, wild hunt. I'm glad that you're in our small village. It's starting. Woods now. Go slaughter. <laughs> Oh snap, that is one hell of an aura for shield. <laughs> Strong alcohol was <laughs> replenished. What a perfect timing. Gonna have to thank Yen once this is all over. That spell, really something. And the invisibility. Hounds could sniff you out, so don't get too close. And you'll be visible as soon as you start fighting, remember that. Good work with these bombs, by the way. Aim at the portals. Be precise. I'm out of Dimeridium. Yen mentioned casting the Erden at the rifts. Said the sign could seal them. They're here. Time to say hello. Slow down. Element of surprise is key. Stay hidden. Give Triss a chance to show them what she can do. Then we'll hit them.
Next time you get the feeling I'm about to piss off Marigold, make sure and knock me upside the head. Roaches pits. Couldn't have asked for anything more perfect. We have the time. Uh -huh, summon. Are you kidding? You're lucky we didn't fall in. Relax. Roach is good at this kind of warfare. The covers won't collapse under our weight. I'm trying to full weight. That's another story. I thought they would at least stagger from that. That did not happen. What? What do we have only two? I saw a crossbow not. There we go. That was weird. Or the ear and sign. Okay. Wow.
that I don't trust this invisibility shit, but we should keep our distance from this creature's mouth so. Bell's wing. We're becoming visible. What's with Marigold? Shit. Now, is the shield gonna disappear too? Wait inside! I cannot hide forever. I must be. I'm now just into the game. Are you now? 78. No. Eh, no. Geralt gave the signal from the woods, and Triss hasn't cast the spell. Damn it! All right, run to her. <laughs> oh yeah, something didn't break his thing. We're pretty soon done with the main story. This is the final battle. And but then we also have the two expansions. Oh my god, can you stop doing those pulses in in the middle of that game? Also storing my favorite character, Regis, one of the coolest high vampires in in, in the Witcher universe.
Those are some beefy uh, elves. GG. They're going to shield us. Yeah, I got that. Oh, come on. Okay, okay. What did it is there really nothing bad to say about this really? It's hard to find bad reasons. Wonder if they took him out. Yeah, doubt it. Uh, I can. Uh, there are some bad things, but o overall, it's mainly good things. Um. I can go on about a few things, but n nothing of it is. Large I can show some approaching stuff from the woods. once the cutscenes are over. The gate before they get inside. I've done uh, quite a bit of gameplay analysis of this. Alright. So, the bad, the dark side of Witcher 3. Here we go. Okay, some of uh, the uh, diverse parts of this game lies actually in the talent trees. Uh, the first part is that if you, uh, if we look into here is that you have a lot of like five paths into each tree. Like this one is the fastest attack, strong attacks, defense, marksmanship, and battle trance. All of these have four different skills in. Now, the bad part here is that you only have 12 slots. In the beginning, at level 1 you have 1 slot, at level 4 you have 2 slots, at level 6 you have 3 slots, and when you are like level 30 you have 12 slots. Basically, when you get to around level 6, you will already feel like you have only 2, two slots. And basically, in my case, for maybe 10 hours I had only these 2 slots, and all I could have was get like 25% fast attack damage and and so on uh, so let's just say that I, I think I at le 20 hours into the game I was level 10 so at that point I had th uh, three slots so it doesn't re but then if you then then you kind of go through here and see that there are so many skills that you would actually want to take but you can't really take them because you don't have enough slots to put them in and that is one of the biggest issues the other also issue is like in this game uh, it takes a long time to gain a level so let's say it, you you need to put uh, at, at one point you will only get five percent more damage when you do a fast attack so imagine doing five level ups only to get an increase of 25 Let's see, during these five level ups you will have spent many hours gaining those levels and you barely get anything out of those points. The problem with this is that you don't really see any char character growth. The way, uh, the, uh, the way you fight at level 1 is literally the way you are gonna fight at level 20, level 30. And basically this is going to be the... yeah, that and that... That is that is pretty much the dark side. Uh, let's say some of these skills are actually very good to only take one point into them. Like for instance, let's see here, Ard, Ard Sweep. This is an alternative uh, way to use Force Push. Kind of what it does, it makes a, a an AOE of the of the Ard, and. Sure, you can put in three points into this, but it doesn't. It changes very, very little. So imagine like you want one point into this, one point into magic trap, maybe one point into fire stream. Then maybe you will also want to go into general. These are only one point stuff, and I kind of like Ormet. And uh, this basically means that you eat something, and then you will regen health for 20 minutes. Uh, if you don't have it, you only regen health from food for five seconds. <laughs> that, that, that's a huge thing. So, let's say that you only have have three slots. So, and we say that you want to be able to cast the alternative of sweep, 
then you maybe want to... The magic trap makes your Irden kind of like to a magic turret that shoots bullets. So let's say that you want to take one point into these, and let's say you have total six points. It's almost same in World of Warcraft, very slow progression. I, I would actually have to say that you actually gain more character progress in the old World of Warcraft talent tree compared to this. But but yeah, th this is kind of the thing. Uh, most of you, you don't have a lot of skill slots and it takes a very long time to attain those skill slots. So most of the time you won't really be able to use the full potential of the talents. Let's see, uh, let's just look look at this, Crippling Strike. Uh, in order to put points into this, you need to put down 30 points! And as you see, I'm at the end of the game and I barely have... I, sure, I've put a bit of 11 points into that, 11 points into that. So maybe I would kind of have uh, like 4 points into this one, if I put all of my talents into one tree, and into one path in the tree. No, wait, n not one path, to one tree. Uh, so yeah, but let's take the other dark side. Okay, we don't have enough skill slots and it takes a long time to attain those. Like, this one, uh, it, this one is mostly passive, it just increases your damage. This one increases your uh, critical hit, uh, your chance a critical hit chance and higher crit damage. Sure. This one mm, makes you to make a spinning attack. This is actually pretty much only uh, some of the few actors. This one gives uh, uh, it gives a bleeding effect. As you see, this one mostly gives us some passives that aren't that special. A strong uh, uh, the strong path is basically the same thing. Here, arrow deflection. This one is actually pretty cool. I would actually want to take one point into this, but the thing is I would not have enough skill slots if I di did that kind of thing. Beat footed, damage reduced while dodging, Count counter attack is actually pretty cool, but not that special. Deadly precision, each adrenaline points add. Okay, that, that one is a bit cool. But if we if we go into here and see his melt armor, this one is worthless. It it does it impacts nothing to the gameplay. I actually had five points into that. Uh, fire stream, that one is cool. Igni intensity, uh, just gives you more intensity. Pyromaniac gives you higher chance burning. All of these skills are kind, are kind of like this. They don't really add too much. Sustained glyph kind of like adds longer duration for a, a for a circle kind of spell, which gives slow and nothing more like that. Mag magic trap is nice. Hidden intensity, more intensity. Supercharged glyph. Basically, you get the damage over time if you're standing in uh, ir Irden. And uh, kind of like here, increases potion odor's threshold. Each potion does imbibe heals 5% of maximum ability. You see, most of these things aren't really that fun. Blade oil is now more charges. Yeah. And this is... This is actually the only downside to uh, Witcher. Uh, some of the spells could actually be more, uh, could be a bit cooler to use, like Irden. It's a very small circle, which gives you, uh, which makes enemies move kind of slow. But they aren't really moving slow enough for it to have any impact. Overall, it's kind of bad. But the but the turret is kind of cool. Hmm and so on yeah but if we if we don't think about this small part of the game everything is flawless basic oh uh, actually there is another thing but does it really affect that much on the gameplay actually I would say that if we removed all of those points all of these points that uh, my talents uh, the only thing that actually would impact the gameplay would be magic trap and uh, sustain and 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 all of the alternative signs like art sweep if we remove that then I won't be able to use it that in, that impacts a bit in how I play uh, far reaching this one no no impact no no impact 
basically no impact, no impact, no impact, no impact, no impact, no impact, impact. Okay, so I have two skills who actually change my gameplay, or rather have an impact on my gameplay. Mm. The Gourmet has some impact, basically because it gives me a, a, a slow HP regeneration that lasts 20 minutes. Basically I don't have to heal in combat. I might get damage in combat, but once it's over then I will go, uh, gain full HP. Uh, in before next combat. So basically three things here have an impact on my gameplay. But that's it. The, the rest are just passives, which I, which is just number crunching. Uh, but, uh, there, there is one more thing, and it actually has to do about gear. Let's look at uh, set items in this game. See, uh, let's say this, I have uh, six pieces of this set. It's actually called the cat. Uh, very interesting. I heard someone not like Talent Tree in the Witcher. Yeah. Actually, a lot of people have kind of been uh, criticizing about the Talent Tree in Witcher, but it's kind of like uh, people who don't really care about Talent Trees and such, they, they like it. People who kind of expect that Talent Trees are supposed to be fun, they will dislike it. Uh, but uh, this is something that not a, not a lot of people are actually taking into account when criticizing the game. How set items work. Set items are all of these green items. Uh, let's say this, I have a feline steel sword, I have feline si silver sword, I have uh, feline armor, feline gauntlets, feline trousers, and feline boots. But let's see here, what does it say? Witcher... Uh, in the middle, Witcher gear zero out of six items must must be upgraded to Grandmaster level to unlock bonuses. Okay, so let's see where, what kind of stuff this can give. Uh, okay, this one isn't uh, as interesting actually, but you see, when you have uh, have three of them, you get a strong attacks increases fast attack. Meh, that one is like boring. Rare attack deals 50% more damage and also stun opponents at a cost of 1 adrenaline points. Huh, that one might not sound a lot, but that one can be interesting. But the question is, I have 6 parts of these, why must I upgrade them to Grandmaster in order to use these things? We are at the end of the game and we have only enhanced version. A superior version requires you to be level 29. Why must we be in like this super super late game after we have beaten the game before we can actually use uh, the uh, the set item effect? In my opinion it should just be that you gather all six pieces and then you can use. Uh, there is actually a set that basically gives you, if you have three pieces then you can cast two spells at the same time. Usually it's this, you cast a spell, your stamina drains, but with this one if you have three pieces you cast a spell then and then the set and then the bonus is, huh? If you've cast a spell, you can cast another spell without uh, using any stamina. And you're like, ooh, we could use kind of like two f uh, two fire spells at the same time. But then the but then the game goes like this. Wait, wait, you need to uh, you need to upgrade these armor pieces to Grandmaster first. And you're like, dude, we have this very cool effects, but we cannot use them. And uh, that's kind of boring. Uh, that's kind of like why? Why do we have uh, these special effects, but we cannot use them until like we have beaten ninety-nine percent of the game already? Like let the players use them, like when they even can get the set. And you will find that people will be able to do this cool stuff throughout the entire game. It would be a win-win situation if you ask me. But yeah, uh, but those are my take, my takes on what are bad in uh, the the bad sides of Witcher 3, and there's only those two two things, and the rest of the game is flawless, just awesome. 
and yeah. Mm, sounds very much like MMORPG gear sets. Yeah, except like in uh, games like uh, when I see porn. Yeah. Close the damn gate. Mm. Like in games like in Diablo 2, you have these cool sets. But the, the, the thing that I like is. Oh, 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 fight so we cannot close jump up. Yeah, I know. We want to close the gate. Happen. Final set up really like to grind even more just to have the abilities. Yeah. The problem is it's more than just grinding. You need to Uh oh. No, Lambert, don't fly. Some things that this game does that basically no other game is doing is the quality of side quests. You know, I've been playing, I've, I've been doing a few side uh, side quests or side quest lines, kind of like contract missions and, and such, which kind of have storytelling even. Have storytelling, voice acted, and everything like told Damn like a story, and you and you're like sitting there for 40 minutes, and you're like, dude, he'll be fine. This isn't We've part of the main quest, right? right? This one feels so main story, you know, kind of kind of like that. Like they've been putting down a ton of storytelling into side, into side quests which most people would kind of like just script up a little, a little bit fast then uh, you know well, not spending too much time fleshing those out and uh, that makes you just want to uh, want to just go to all of the side quests and start and like uh, dive into 
kind of like the story that is going to be told. And as far as I know, you, you, you also have an impact on how the story will end. Like it can end sadly, it can end... Yeah. Most of those side quests usually end in two different ways, one sad ending and one nice ending. And that I kind of find pretty cool. Right. Yes. Because sometimes you can, you can kind of feel like, oh, damn, I took that wrong back. decision, so this happened instead. And that leaves you a bit of feeling that, man, you should have thought, uh, thought, uh, thought through goal? a bit more. <laughs> He's in trouble. I'm going to help him. And that's nice. Remember the a lot of decisions uh, goes back into the self reflecting. Cells. Something tells me a skull is gonna die. That's a cool name. Pretty sick arm, uh, sick in defense that they're having. How could you even slice through such a thing? Y you would actually need something like a warhammer to actually stand a chance. <laughs> I'm having you here. Have to open Sweet the gate dreams. See you around. Retreat beyond it! Fall back! You're not supposed to be out here. Too late now. They're coming in through the gaps! Time Iridium bombs. You'll find more in the crates by the walls. Oh yeah. Hold them back! I'm a 
See. 
I adored that about you. I see the dagger. Now fly. Are you teleporting them? No. Nothing else. <laughs> Dang. She would make a damn good opera singer, Kappa. And heavy metal. Oh no. Is this a black hole? Take it that wasn't the final battle. Oh. And Vesemir died as expected. I was too late to help him. It's not your fault. I should not have fled here to Camorn. Avalark is weak, but alive. Triss is tending to the others. I nearly killed you. Killed everyone.
we'd all be dead if not for you. No, Geralt. The hunt would never have come to Kaer Morhen if I wasn't here. Vesemir's funeral. We should prepare. Yourself. No witcher's ever died in his own bed. You don't know how it is to see someone you love die because of you, for you. We all knew what we were signing up for. Yes, and you saved me. For how long? A week? A month? We'll hide you, cover your tracks. No. I will flee no more. He's gonna take the fight to them. Gerald, you should follow. Va fail. Oh, the elf. For those who remain, death should never take precedence over life. Pay your last respects to your friend. Then we must hold counsel. Zirel can harness immense amounts of the power. Why has no one taught her to control this? Actually, some did teach her. Clearly, to no effect. Haven't had a chance to talk. Thanks for your help. And for looking after Siri. You will thank me later. Now we must take Zirel from here, Haida. And then gather a greater force. Anyone, everyone we could count on came here to care Morhen. Which is why we must seek the help of enemies. Magic is our best defense against the hunt. We need sorceresses, arch mistresses of magic. You mean the lodge? Many of the lodge's members are dead. The rest are in hiding. Philippa Eilhart, Margarita Loantil, and Frangilla Vigo are likely still alive. And Francesca and Ida? Think they'd agree? I think they'll take convincing. Would you rather speak to Kira alone? That would probably be best.
Don't trust the Lodge one bit, but doesn't seem like we have a choice. Because we don't. I've made an agreement with the Emperor. In exchange for its help, the Lodge will be granted amnesty and find asylum in Nilfgaard. That will be our bargaining chip. Triss, I wish to leave today to find the sorceresses. Will you help me? Of course. Even got an idea where you could start. Damn it! Again you planned without even asking what I think. I've heard enough of this. I won't be taken somewhere like a bundle. I will not sit and twiddle my thumbs. I am sick of waiting, sick of hiding. You're right. Prove today you can take care of yourself. Easier to pat someone on the back and hope things will work out than it is to face the truth. Jirel possesses a great power she cannot control. She is a danger to herself, to others. Until she learns to control it, she should remain isolated. First of all, bollocks. Second, if you're going to speak of courage, at least address me directly, and not through Geralt. I'm gone. <laughs> Better go after her. Wait, she needs time. We must let her resolve her grief on her own. Then we should start training as soon as possible. She must learn to control her abilities. This training really necessary? You saw what happened. She could be a greater threat than the hunt. Fine. We'll stay here a while longer, then join you and Triss in Novigrad. Meet at Dandelion's Inn. Mm. Come on, Yen. The sooner we leave, the better. See ya. Interesting. Hey! This is gonna go on! I actually thought that would be the end. Don't you see? Discouraged after a mere eight attempts? Sierra. How many times must I try? As many as it takes. But I'm not getting anywhere. We shall return to this later. Didn't make it far first time out on the gauntlet either. Oh, Geralt, please, not now. <laughs> By comparison, the gauntlet was a walk in the park. But that's not the point. What is? Avalar says nothing will come of this until I stop thinking about the battle. But at the moment, I find it impossible to fill my head with kittens and vanilla pudding. Tell me, how do you do it? What? Always manage to pull yourself together. Focus. No matter what's happening. Hmm. There's a certain ancient method. Vesemir taught it to me, and Barman taught it to him. Will you take me into the mountains and make me drink hemlock? <laughs> the Skellica druids have used it for centuries. It always works. Hey! You'll regret that. Hey, that's cheating. <laughs> Win. We'll see about that. <laughs> Come and get me. Okay, so how do we take up? Uh, okay, you cannot take up snowballs. 
What do we make? More snowballs. Apple. Okay. Okay, there you go. Trying to find places to oh okay we cannot pick up the snowball just yet. What the hell? What? That missed? Um What the hell? Up aim no flame camera? Are you serious? What? Oh, I'm okay. <laughs> oh, I will thrash you. Hey, cheating. You were right. That really works. Thanks. Glad to be of service. So what now? I'll go see where our dearest sage is. Saddled the horses. Siri, it's the crack of dawn. Where do you want to go? To Velen, Bald Mountain. But a few days till the Witch's Sabbath. And guess who's the guest of honor? Don't know. Enlighten me. Imerith. We'll have no better chance to get him. Where do you get this idea? What's gotten into you? I must avenge Vesemir. The Sabbath. It's the perfect opportunity. Imlarith will be drunk among his cohorts, caught up in the revelry. He'll not expect the blow. How do you learn all this? Imlarith? The Sabbath? Avilach. He told me of those who chase us. <clears throat> Elm's knowledge itself can tip the scales. Come, we shall talk on the way. Lead on.
Ready? Let's go. After the Battle of Kaer Morhen, the defenders licked their wounds and mourned their losses, save Ciri, who began to plan her revenge. She woke Geralt one night and urged him to travel with her to Velen, to the top of Bald Mountain, where she knew she'd find Imlarith. She had decided he had to die. And let's take him out. The men at Crow's Perch, they spoke of this place. Ard Serbin, home of the ladies of the wood. The peasants feared coming here, and the barons thought the ladies of the wood a terrifying tale for naughty children. Incidentally, I wonder how the baron is. He found his wife, took her away somewhere far. Anna, she was unwell. A true shame. Let's get this done. We must reach the peak. We'll find Imlarith there. The peasant folk of Velen call this night the fifth. Hmm. We have three points. This is nice. of footprints. A crowd of peasants came through here. Geralt? Geralt? Avalach claims vanity is Imlaris's greatest weakness. Vanity? Any foe he faces, he strives to impress. The other one, Caranthir, is said to be secretive and pragmatic. Hardly surprising, given he was Avalach's student. I cannot run. That's a shame. Let them approach. They've come for the feast. Wouldn't do to cast them out. Didn't come to celebrate. We need to get to the top of the mountain. The gate is shut. You'll not pass. 
but we fires down that away with food and drink aplenty. Sit down beside one, and perhaps this year the ladies will descend. Give us the privilege of seeing them. We thank you for the invitation. Be glad to sit down, right? Speak for yourself. Come with me. Ladies of the wood visit you? If they favor us. My father told me they descended once. Passed from fire to fire, listening to hopes and grievances. So each year, we wait for them to walk amongst us once more. Haven't done it in a long time, then. No point waiting to see if we'll get lucky. Yeah, we gotta try to reach the peak. This celebration, what's it about? What do you need to know, Wanderer? No need for anger. The White Ones serve the ladies as we do now. We send them gifts all year long. And on this night, they repay us with their blessing. I met one of your gifts to the crones. Sniveling, scared to death, and about eight years old. Stay calm. Your children. Why do the ladies need them? We know not and never ask. You don't know? Then let me tell you. Tell us instead what a peasant, his own young and starving, is to do with a wandering war orphan. You're not from here. Don't judge us by others' laws. Said the ladies bestow blessings on you. Aye. For our lives turn thus. First a summer of labor neath the hot sun, then autumn rains, then a winter of death. Then we await spring, when all that is dead is born anew. And from our blood and sweat, the oak bears acorns, at times few, at times a handful. What do you do with the acorns? The Velen elders gather, hold council, some favor grinding them to spread on the fields for a rich harvest. Others want them given to a cunning woman who would make medicine for consumption. A handful of enchanted acorns is enough for all Velen. Tis never enough. Heard enough about this. We've got other questions. We should be going. Eager to see the ladies, I share your yearning. Mm -hmm. We're afire with yearning. Come, Geralt, we must get there before daybreak. Go to the tent and stand before Thecla. She's the one who decides who's worthy to face the ladies. Mm. Right, over the front Yeah? So long. Up there, yeah? Look, a child. No, a godling. I know him. Name's Johnny. Well, old B, you're back. And I see you found your last. I'm Johnny. We've had the pleasure already. A bit one-sided, though, it was. See, I saw you running. You're back to me, as I was <laughs> having the pleasure of... Oh, tis a long story. They call me Siri. Nice to meet you. How are things, Johnny? Health's good, so no complaints. What brings you here? 
We gotta climb the mountain. Can you help? I'd rather try to dissuade you. I'm certain that would be in vain. The lass, she is stubborn as you. Even more so. Figured as much. Oh. Path to the peak starts there, past the gate. But only old Thekla's got the key, so since you shan't ever get it, you best turn back now. The key. Why do you doubt we can get it? Good grief! You're worse than children! <laughs> Three souls are allowed atop the mountain, and only strapping young lads or comely lasses among them. They get the key, open the gate, and meet the ladies. Oh, well, they're probably devoured. I believe I qualify. But he's old and ugly. What good is he? Pretty damn good at finding lost voices. Then go find the voice of reason. It'll tell you to turn back. There's no fooling with the ladies. Gotta get to the summit. Simple as that. It's Thecla you'll need to convince. She's blind as your bum, but she won't be fooled. We shan't try to trick her. She sits in that tent over yonder. I wish you luck, and do hope we meet again, someday. <laughs> Gotta love Janet. It's clearing up. Mm, who's that? Well, come on, come closer, girl. Aye. What's she like? Narrow hips, sparkly eyes, a striking feisty lass. Never had a man. Got me answer. I choose you, girl. This night you shall see the ladies. Siri. Wonderful. Who wouldn't want to meet the ladies? My companion comes with me. <laughs> what else is the cat dragged in? It's grey and veiny, got a scar, and eyes like a viper. I stinks of clotted blood and corpses. Plus it's old and infertile. I reject ye, freak. The girl will ascend alone. You misjudged me. I'm worthy as anyone. Mm. Girl? He's sprier than any youth. Only smells like corpses because he kills monsters. And he'll kill any who stand in his way. Perhaps I was mistaken. Perhaps there's life in him yet. By ancient right you may appeal my choice. But to do so you must best the challenge. I accept the challenge. <laughs> Come. Look this over. A coin from days of yore. Falker burns on its reverse, so they call it the Defiers Orb. Oh, okay, we're gonna now, get down and bring, bring me the coin. <laughs> Something's afoot.
Interesting. Tossed in the lake. It reeks of sludge. Nothing I can do about that. So, gonna keep your word? I always do, my boy. Show the coin to the gatekeeper past the threshold. He'll know its meaning. Marika will open the gate for you. Now go. That went smoothly. Weren't the one to do the diving in that cave. Stop. You're a witcher. You dived in murky waters. Yeah, I have to tell you about the time I hunted a Zubo. <laughs> Something's afoot. Something's not. Seen in the boat already. Mom! Mom! Look, he's there. If only I could have done to this this year. Oh, is it time to kill hmm. the crows? What's your name, girl? Oh, it's him. What's yours? <clears throat> your name don't matter. Atop the peak, you'll lose it and get another. You may go. And you? I passed the trial. Here's proof. Recognize it? The Defiers, Oren. A death sentence. No time to lose. I'll tend to Imlirith, you take the crones. Avalark said they dwell below the oak, among its roots. No chance. I'm going after Imlirith. <sighs> Fine, let's play for it. Rock, paper, scissors. Hmm. <laughs> Out of the question. I'll climb the mountain, you face the crones. Hardly a challenge. They're extremely dangerous. Be careful. You too. Let's get down there. Oh. 
Hello, Crow. That's somebody's hand. Can I go into the area? Yeah, there we go. Those were your solutions or something. Welcome, child of the Elder Blood. We knew you would return. Your taste lingers on our tongues. You've talked enough. Oh fuck, I understand. Naughty, naughty girl! Naughty, 
Loppers. Him the right set the summit. Gotta be. Oh boy. Sisters said you would come. They saw you arrive in the water's surface. They did not see the girl. But she is with you, is she not? I'm here alone. A lie which will change nothing.
Not good. Okay, parrying did not work, and sidestepping into his attack was the brightest thing we could do. Yeah, but. Alright, let's get ready. What? A oh my. Oh. Mm, magic. A place of power. Oh.
shit. Oh, finally! It's a matter of oh. magnitude. Thank you, Alfina, for the host hype. And welcome, oh oh. And welcome, Raiders. Sir, bit hectic this fight. What's what's up, Alfina Viren? Here we go. And yeah, we're counting this epic. Pulse fire, uh oh. Shit. No! Oh. Captain. And how are you guys doing? I said good yeah. day, sir! Thank you for the follow, villain! My tiny epic raids! Destroy your shell. Don't worry. <laughs> you should be more worried about <laughs> mistaking and being global. Ooh, oh. Uh oh. And how are you guys doing this epic Wednesday evening? Whoop. There we go. And this epic Imlerith guy. Uh oh. How have you been doing, friends? I've been doing awesome. Lots of studying and lots of witcher. And how are you guys doing? Who oh. else? Who taught you to fight like this? Welcome, Koala. And thank you for the follow. Oh boy. Wait a pretty boy, it's a D. He doesn't look so good. I think he's doing perfectly fine. He's he just got a bit of smashing headache. Kappa. Well, he did get a quite a pretty tan though. A bit sunburned, <laughs> but that's all. We did it. Barely. How'd it go down there? We slew only two of the crones. The third fled with Vesemir's medallion, my sole memento. Coming here? Good idea. I knew we'd succeed from the start. 
now to find Eredin and kill him. Mm. An Orin for your thoughts? Wondering what to tell <laughs> Yennefer when we get to Novigrad. Tell her the truth. Always. I wonder if Triss and Yennefer have found the sorceresses at the lodge. We ought to rejoin them. Oh. Yeah, let's get going. Thank you for coming with me. Come here. Let's go. Dead. The oak, the crones. I fear that was your last feast. What of our acorns? Your acorns? No idea. Path to the summit's clear. You can always go looking for them. Hmm. Or just go home? This is no longer no man's land. It's no longer the lady's land. It's all yours. What are we to do? Come, Geralt. It's time. Manage on your own. Hmm. Nice! At least nice. Now, the ladies of the woods are dead. They were horrendous beasts. And now they can begin to party! Well, on the bright side, they will not need to cut off their ears and such and give them to the crones. That is nice. Patty! Oh yeah! Ooh, kinda looked like Sebastian, kid. I like parties. Oh, we all do. Epic parties hype! Mm -hmm. Loading. Loading screen. Oh. Old Mountain. It is Bastion. Nice. I have Grumpy too. Ooh. You do. Grumpy. Party. Yeah. But it was mages the hunters and the temple guard were after. Mages left. Hunters needed a new quarry. Oh boy. But didn't we kill the temple guards? All of them? Hatred and prejudice will never be eradicated. And witch hunts will never be about witches. To have a scapegoat, that's the key. Humans always fear the alien. This game now, seems intense. Once the it mages is. had left Novigrad, folk turned their anger against the other races. And as they have for ages, branded their neighbors their greatest foes. First they were out for witch hunts, then the mages left. So they went for the elves and dwarves. Burned them on stake. Ready some tankers with gifts. Geralt! Siri! So I can meet the host animals. When I learned I... Geralt had found you. Glad to see you in one piece of dandelion. Where have you two been? Dandelion's real name is actually Buttercup. <laughs> and I'm not joking, it actually is. In Polish it's Jaskier, but the English translation for that is Buttercup. They didn't like it, so Just they went with Dandelion the Velen, instead. The general of the wild hunt. Well, you would have any more than then, wouldn't you? In fact, you look terrible. Like you could really use some rest. Gladly take some. Point me to a room. Of course. Come on, little swallow. I'll take you. Let's meet later, Geralt. A little matter to resolve. I'll freshen up, then await you in the square in Gildorf. Right. Anything happen? 
happened while we were away. Uh, pretty Polly came down with a fever, Matt Oyster caught a knife between the ribs, and they're late delivering the sodden triple meat. Dandelion. Lodge of sorceresses. Triss and Yen were supposed to gather the remnants. They're working on it. Triss is upstairs, waiting for you. Yennefer's gone to crippled Kate's. Need to go finish yeah. my dinner? At that port side oh. dive. Why? Sounds awesome! Morning. Enjoy your Imagine meal! That. Ah. And I'll, that elf I'll hopefully it's back soon. To the ruby suite. Soon TM. Take that your time. Too. Dinner is one of the highlights of the day. And it should always be fully enjoyed. Gave him your best room? He didn't exactly ask. <laughs> I prepared another room for him, but he blew past me and locked himself in the ruby. Hasn't peeked out since. Barely eats, drinks it's only not going water, to be done for and the only thing I've heard but from him is next step time. I wish to nice. know when Windblade and Zeriel arrive. Thanks. Looks like I'll have my hands full. Nice music. Ooh. Dr. Yennefer, I'm serious to take care of her business in the weekend. Yeah. Much no. Okay, final I'm preparation. Cool. Oh boy. Huh. Hey, we're level 29. Oh boy, oh boy, we're level 29. This is good. Level 29 means a few sort of things. Huh. First off... We need to go to... Hattori! Hattori Sensei! On the guy shimmels. Yeah, but the uh, elf Hattori has some cool it's things go going on. Okay, we're level 29. This means we can upgrade our current armor to a superior version. And Hattori! Oops. Greetings, Ibeer. Greetings, Geralt. How might I be of help? I like to Listen, craft something. Would you craft something for me? Why, of course! Uh, oh. So let's look here, superior version, this, steel sword, feline superior, yes, there we go, alright, very well, so long. Did they, oh, they actually put it, put them straight in as well. Nice, superior. Okay, yeah. now we gotta find. Oh boy, I know where she is. Okay, let's go to the glory gate. I wish we could move. Oh right. Oh no, not another oh, one of those situations. Fine, guys. Loonies. Mm. Oh man. That's not a way to get out. Okay, it's. There we have it. Oh. Oh no. Yes. Okay, so we need to upgrade our armor, and it's gonna look different, actually, so that's nice. But in order to get there, we need to run quite far away. So let's do this part first. Pop, pop. Oh. Oh. Uh, over here. Prowl's Purge. We also have some bug going on here. We cannot get our horse. 
in order to get, in order to be able to whistle for our horse, we actually need to re uh, load the game and watch a cutscene and such. So, wait. Oh, girl. Oh, that girl was called Siri. Okay, let's run. There we go. And now we're gonna talk to this lady. Geralt, good of you to come by. What can I do for you? Master uh, craftswoman. It makes some it's some armor. Armor. All right. Now, where are they? Master superior. Superior feline boots. Oh, we need dark steel ingot. Profit components, dark. Oh, what? No. <laughs> Hopefully, we have enough. Mm. What? Didn't we actually make... Dark steel ingots. Oh, good. We have tons of these. Superior uh, feline boots. Check. Armor. Superior feline armor. Where do we have you? There we go. Gauntlets. Superior feline gauntlets. There we go. And now go for trousers. Pair of feline trousers. Cool. And we have some upgrades here too. Mm, armor piercing could be good. Take care. Is. This is attack power. Attack power. Where is armor piercing? This one. Ten piercing. No. Ah, there we have it. There we go. Okay, 
That's enough. All right. Now we just gotta head back. We got our stuff. Piece of cake. Hopefully. Oh, yeah. Reconnecting. It went up again. Come on, we came out of it fine. Can't say the same for Imbrith. That's the sole comfort I find in this. Welcome back. There's no justification. You know what might have happened? But it didn't. I was there, had the situation under control. Mind if we change the subject? burning pyres on the way into town, non-humans on them. Things grow worse by the day. No mage is left in the city, so the hunters had to find someone else to victimize. We need to resolve everything as quickly as possible and leave Novigrad. Any success with the lodge? Anyone out there willing to help? It doesn't look good. Ida outright refused, while Francesca won't budge from her little realm with a war raging. We don't know about Fringilla. Haven't been able to contact her. And the others? Kira, Margarita, Philippa? Kira? I thought you of all people would know. Few can refuse a sorceress. And Kira Metz certainly had her ways. Mm. When she demanded the Mage Alexander's notes, I had to turn her down. Kira needed that. As she needed the impetus to start anew, she found it. Where she least expected to. Years later, known for discovering the cure for the Catriona Plague, she was thankful none remembered her time in hiding as a village witch. I've seen worse matches. Hope things work out for them. I hope they work out for us, and we actually find Philippa and Rita. Know where they are? Yennefer's looking into Rita's whereabouts. I have to figure out where Philippa is. Hmm. Know what Yen's found out? You'll need to ask her. I've been busy trying to find Philippa. So, learn anything? A few things that could be interesting. Prefer the long version or the short? Tell 
me everything. I want the details. After fleeing Loch Muin, Philippa ended up here in Novigrad. She sought help from her former lover, the sorcerer Arthur de Vleister. De Vleister rings a bell. Philippa had made a fool of him once. Arthur was out for revenge. He convinced her she'd be safest as an owl. She transformed, and he placed a dimeridian band on her leg. The mage hunt started shortly afterwards. Sadly, Arthur fell victim. They auctioned off his estate. Just so happened a certain dwarven acquaintance of ours stumbled on the auction. Sultan. Huh. So Philippa was here under our noses the whole time? Was, precisely. Zoltan lost her in a card game a few days ago. Hmm. Kidding, right? Sadly, no. A man showed up here, fleeced Zoltan Bear, then proposed they play for the owl. Naturally, he won, then politely thanked Zoltan for the game and left. And what's up? Who was? Know where he lives? He's not from here. No one knows him. Great. We got any leads? We have this. That Philip of the Owl's feather? Thinking divination? Specifically hydromancy, and a form of sortilage. We need a fountain where we won't be disturbed. Doing fine here, didn't work properly there, though. Oh. I hope you enjoy the game. It looked kinda iffy if you uh, stream this game a bit. Nice! One outside the Passiflora could work. Good idea. Let's go. Man, I'm loving this song. So good. Oh. Here it is a bit iffy. The game is apparently pretty awesome. I've seen people stream it. I don't know what a lot, what people's why people We're say here. it's awesome. Nice and quiet. Shouldn't be any disturbances. The hack and slash is performed in slow motion, like Observe the water purely in slow motion. It has incredibly yeah. weird yeah. top-down yeah. shooters yeah. with yeah. amazingly yeah. horrendous yeah. controls. Looks familiar. Mm. The bathhouse. I know the place. Dijkstra. He has her at his bathhouse. Mm. Might have guessed as much. Mm. I was pretty surprised that Platinum Games had actually made the product because the kind of the quality of what I saw from the gameplay was particularly low to, uh, for being a near uh, for being a Platinum game. Didn't get far enough in the game to get that emo. Yeah. That's but I good. hope it's good. I hope it's better it. than Come what on. I saw. But so far I I think I'm gonna say that Platinum's best game is still gonna be Metal Gear uh, Metal Gear Rising. I don't know about their Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles game. It seems pretty nice. Their Avatar game. It was on a pretty low budget, time. so that game has suffered a lot the possibilities are many. from budget issues. Be Dijkstra that got hurt. Not likely. Dijkstra never forgave her for sending assassins after him. And Philip is weakened, no doubt about it. Weakened, maybe, but still a powerful sorceress. If Dijkstra's men take the Dimeridium off, Philip will kill them before they can but see yeah, But shit. Nier Automata is, is one of those games that I re would really like to kind of... Uh, dive down and analyze to see what is bad and what is good. Guess they underestimated Philippa. Surrender! This place is a maze, witch! You'll never get out! <laughs> we'll handle this. Oh no, no, no. The sorceress stays here. We're going together. Not a chance. It's fine, Gerald. I'll stay. In case she tries to flee this way. Fine. Be right back.
Ooh, actually. Well, get going. Damn, she cast a spell on them. Can we use? Oh no! I can't jump down until they are dead. Oh, bollocks! Okay, I didn't want to kill you guys, but I have to do it because I cannot climb up. Like you. Otherwise, there we go. Now we can climb up here. Like she just ate a hundred old drowners. But no one. Drowner make egg very bad. Let me pass. I can help her. <laughs> but let pass go. With your help. This is why Bart is awesome. He only thinks about others. Oh no, I can't jump? Oh. I might be dead here. Oh, okay, good. We could get past it.
the exit. So quiet all of a sudden. dead by now. Oh, what do you want? To torment me? To watch others do so? I need your help. Betray me, and I will... Relax. Not planning on it. Triss is outside. She'll explain everything. Hey, Philippa, you betrayed us already. Deepest apologies, but the lady will come with me. Dijkstra, I don't have time for this. Get out of my way. I've no quarrel with you, Geralt, but Phil and I have lots to talk about. Remember the assassins you sent after me, darling Phil? A grave error. Such matters ought to be handled personally, as I will now demonstrate. I like you, Dijkstra. Don't make me hurt you. Save your threats for the rats that run about the port. They don't make the slightest impression on me. Philippa will come with me and answer for all the courtesies she's paid me. That's the second time his leg went bonkers. Sorry to take so long, but I had to deal with the guards. Hello, Triss. Philip, are you alright? I've been better. I'll get you out of here. Gonna be alright? Yeah, thanks for your help. with Trez. Now let's go to Avalak. I think I think at least it's Avalak that we are running to. I would like to uh, respect. No idea where we can find those, though. But it doesn't really matter too much. No loitering round here. Friend always. See you, Dandelion. Oh, he is even higher up. We 
there. Oh, there. Okay. Need a hanky? Gotta admit, never expected this of you. <laughs> you humans have mm, unusual tastes. How did you fare on board, Mante? Need to ask? You're a sage. I ask as a courtesy. A concept you clearly forgot when you left without uttering a word. Siri was in a hurry. I know, so she wrote in her letter. But that is not my concern. You eliminated Imlareth adeptly. So adeptly you might say you inspired me. <laughs> Meaning? The loss of one of his great generals has weakened Eredin significantly. Two others remain. How do we get rid of them? Caranthia is a loyalist, but Gels, that is another story. He was a devoted follower of our former king. Oh, did we kill him? And as it happens, Eredin poisoned our beloved ruler. Regicide. Serious stuff. Take it not many know about this. Of the living? Only I. And Eredin, of course. Question is, can you get Gels to believe you? Nothing you need worry about. Fine. So what do you propose? Why to bring Gels here? Show him the truth of what happened. Fabulous plan. If we only knew where to find him. We do. In the land of the ML. Land of the NL? You don't recall. After all, you ah, did travel with Eridin for the wild, time. The Wildlands plant, uh, world. The land of the Elder Folk. The world where we arrived centuries ago. A world that is now our home. The Red Riders come from there. And it is there where we will find Gels. Think you're forgetting something. You and Ciri might know how to travel between worlds. But me? Not so much. You clearly know there are many other worlds apart from the one where we now stand. They're linked by passages, hidden gateways that afford travel from one world to another. Of course, few know of these gateways. Even fewer can locate them. Elven sages, for example? For example. One such passage will open soon near where we are, fortuitously enough. Between this noble edifice and the butcher's yard. That's our chance. Shall we go? Let's go. Nice. Sadly. Sadly. It's getting per late. I, know I mean, it's almost 11 p.m. and I need to go up Supposed in six hours. Decided it no. Was harmless. Seven hours. So. It's time for sleep. We will actually tomorrow. We will be able, probably be be able to beat the base game. Uh, so, and then we gotta do the expansions for this game. We got them all. <laughs>